Hello again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 31st of January, 2019. Just watched a rather informative, somewhat disturbing video put up by Brian of High Impact Flicks. It was published on the 31st of January, 2019, titled, What Are They Hiding From You About the Houston Shooting Story? When I got it, it had 30,919 views. I posted a couple of videos on that exact event, and what did I say in those videos? Well, what I said is that I've watched Dallas SWAT, and I've seen how they pull up in their bulletproof vehicles, and how they attach grappling hooks to the front of the house. I saw one where they tore the entire front of the house off, and then they yelled police. I said in one of the videos that I posted, it's quite possible that the homeowners thought they were being invaded by drug dealers, if in fact they were dealing drugs. What I didn't know is what I learned in this video. When they entered, they shot the family dog. And they weren't wearing uniforms, which is what I said in my videos as well. So what would you do if someone broke into your house and shot your dog? I know what I'd do. I'd shoot back. They thought they were being invaded, a home invasion. They've spoken to neighbors who said they never dealt with drugs. The man that was killed, he was a veteran, a disabled veteran, no criminal record. They found a little bit of marijuana and a little bit of white powder don't know what the white powder is, but how many homes do you think you're going to find marijuana in in Houston? And the woman that was killed, well, she was trying to take away a gun from someone that she thought was trying to kill them. Again, they weren't wearing uniforms. And what they do is they smash down a door and they yell police. Well, how do they know that it's police? And who's investigating the shooting? The same police department that executed the raid. And as Brian says, it happens quite often. They go to the wrong house. They received erroneous information. Folks, I don't know if those two had a family, but if they had a family, they need to sue the hell out of the Houston Police Department. And the neighbors should sue as well, having to deal with all that trauma that they were exposed to. One woman said, I spoke to her every day for 20 years, the woman that was killed. They don't deal drugs. They've never dealt with drugs. You see what happens? Huh? It's going to get a whole lot worse before it gets a whole lot better. Watch the clip. Pass it along to your like-minded friends. Repost it in all your social media accounts. Crap like this needs to stop, but it won't. You know why? Because there's no one to go to. Go watch Dallas SWAT, see how they operate. Totally effing insane. That's what I think. Seems to be what Brian thinks as well. Thanks for listening.